and an arm in governmental organization champion and the cause of persons living with disability in the arts and creative sector. It's calling on the federal government to set aside 5% of the fund for persons with disabilities and their investments in digital and creative enterprises. The call was made during the conclusion of a three-day creative boot camp for persons with disabilities in Abuja. Plus, if Emmanuel Ehejene completes the story. Creative Director, Potter's Gallery Initiative, Donald Unanka, together with other stakeholders amongst persons with disabilities, arts, and creative sector, are calling on the federal government to set aside 5% of the $680 million investment in digital and creative enterprises project launched by the federal government on the 14th of March this year. He says this demand is in line with an existing disability law which stipulates 5% of appointments, jobs, and opportunities in every sector be reserved for PWDs. The disability law stipulates that 5% of appointments, jobs, and opportunities in every sector be reserved for persons with disabilities. I want to use this medium to call on government to ensure that persons with disabilities are actively included in the IDAS project. This will create over 120,000 jobs for persons with disabilities in the art and the creative industries. This is in line with the United Nations Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities, the Disability Law, and other international instruments. He commended the media for being a worthy partner in educating Nigerians on the plight of persons with disabilities in the country, while assuring that Potter's Gallery is ready to provide technical assistance to PWDs who eventually benefit from the IDICE project fund. I want to use the occasion of the Creative Bootcamp to sincerely thank the media for their support in providing coverage for issues of persons with disabilities in the arts and creative industry ecosystem in Nigeria. It is very important to note that without the media, it will be very difficult to understand issues of persons with disabilities in this space. Stakeholders at the event also supported as they called for more government funding for PWDs. This is not the first time a grant or loan is being released for job in this country. Some three years ago, some funds were released to give MSME and persons with disabilities. MSME had four point something billion. Persons with disabilities had 2.5 billion. But we couldn't get that money. We are appealing to government to please carry us along in this new money that is released so that we benefit out of it. We have a very challenging situation. Even as normal people that have no challenges, uh, physical challenges, cost of movement, cost of uh, living is so high. Then when you put this together and look at the conditions of people with disabilities, it's, it is a situation that calls for immediate government uh, interventions in different ways. The boot camp is a yearly event where participants are given opportunities to showcase their talents before a large audience in an atmosphere of friendship and love. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.